harsh, you guys. I can't believe none of us stood a chance. I went in thinking it couldn't be all that bad, but what the heck was that about? I'm more bothered that our target seemed to know us. Are you serious, Blonde? We're famous. Everyone knows us. It could have been Game Industry's most elusive bum, for all we know. I feel as though I've seen that particular mech design before. You too? I feel the same way. It looks like an abandoned design from early last station days. Rather, it took inspiration from one of our early designs. Where did it come from? Hmm, I see. Supposing it also adopted scrapped plans from early lean box, that would explain its strength. I don't care about lean box, but it took one of my nation's designs. I've got to burn it to ash. We are in agreement, Ben Noir. I cannot allow such a thing to run rampant. We must find a countermeasure before the monsters gain further momentum. If our attacks don't work, though, what countermeasure can we use? Should we try ambushing it? I'd never do something so cowardly. If we can hurt it, we can kill it. We'll attack it head on! There's no telling how long such an approach would take. Although, the idea of fighting all day is alluring. For you two, maybe. I'd rather wrap it up in time for snacks and naps. Know any super ultra special moves? My best attack didn't do anything. What? When'd you use that? Sorry to interrupt, but, um... If nobody's moves worked, I have a suggestion. How about we come up with a brand new special attack? One that the CPUs invent, which leads to the destruction of game industry's latest threat. That's an award-winning article right there. It feels like something out of a kid's manga. A special move that can save game industry sounds great. It may sound great, but how will we come up with such a thing? It may prove to take quite some time. A move stronger than anything else we've used up till now. A way to draw all our powers out. The combined powers of Louis, Planetune, Last Station, and Leanbox. For something like that, we'll need everyone's help. Can we do it? You betcha. I can hear the cheering of Game Industries people begging for me to be their awesome savior again. We may be able to pull it off. Leanbox's power is the mightiest in game industry, as we all know. Why do you sound so incredulous, Blonde? Don't you trust your people? Man, I feel so bad for them. What? I offered an idea because you dumb skanks couldn't think of any. I'll show you why Louise number one. That's the Blonde everyone likes to see. in this scene they're talking about a bunch of hard stuff to understand so I don't care our big sisters will know what to do yeah you're right we'll do whatever we can then Miss Netgear what are you doing experimenting I want to see how to best apply the cool design and power of our enemy into my own robots very fine frame Smooth movement, the armor's resilience, and silent motion. It was a true work of art. Oh, really? I thought it was scary. What about you, Ram? I wasn't scared, but it looked like a toy I saw before or something. Wah! I just can't remember! I think I remember that toy too, but I can't remember either. Maybe we both dreamed it? Dream! I was just thinking that! Maybe we gotta go take a nap and dream about it again! Enough fooling around! Our sisters look like they found a solution. We are going to put our heads together and come up with a special move using all our nation's powers. A move like that would be great to help me grow stronger. 
Use the power of each nation? Oh! Maybe Planetu can finally turn into a big robot! Goodness, so cool! Huh? Is that what Blonde meant? I... I can't wait to see it! Wow, that's awesome! Maybe all four nations can combine to become one massive super giant robot then! I guess that sounds neat. But there's no way that's possible! Nothing's impossible, Uni! The four lands, game industry will link together in robotic glory! And then we'll unleash our super special robotic attack! The mighty game industry rocket fist of goodness! Oh, maybe the last station part of the robot has turrets everywhere! This is sounding pretty great! Okay, it's settled then! We'll make the super duper ultra final move! The game industry cannon! Rom, this is the coolest thing ever! Let's hurry up and make up a sweet move with Blonde, too! <sighs> I'm so excited! Yeah, uh, great to see everyone so excited, but I did tell you that this isn't actually possible, right? I won't let it bother me now. Let's do our best to think of a real move, one that's even better. Something fun got added, huh? Yeah! Now loading! Spinny, spinny, round and round. What are you doing? Staring at that there toothy wheel thing, Neptunior? Oh, hi, Neptune! This is called a gear, and it has our dreams infused in it. Uh, then it would be made of candy. Regardless, I'll humor you. What are you gonna use it for? I wanted it to be a secret, but I'm trying to see how I could make you as popular as I think you should be. If I infuse this magical gear with your popularity, meaning your shares and power as a CPU, then... I hope to make the popularity boom, breaking the barriers of gender, race, and negating our world's pesky gravity. That way, everything will be sucked into the black hole of cuteness that you are, uniting all of game industry. It would instantly resolve any and all quests, and even keep that mean next-gen mech off our cases. Ultimately, you and I would have our accomplishments published, and we'd become super popular forever! Uh-huh. You sure said a lot of stuff that some would consider insane, but hooray! I'm so happy and stuff, sis. But seriously, that sounds like a sociopathic villain's plan. The article would be about how you ended the world. You'll see, Neptune. They'll all see. My device isn't ready yet, but we'll make game industry a better place. Don't do anything too crazy, Dr. Gear. I mean, my popularity is so off the charts, it circled the entire world. Oh, in that case, I need to power up the gear to allow for a longer line so your popularity doesn't lap itself. Excellent. I'm going to step out and praise the sun in order to supercharge the gear with vitamin D. Okay, you do that, kiddo. I'm getting bad vibes from this whole situation, so I'm gonna go buy snacks. Now loading. Had this in the wings, huh? Uh-huh. Yep. I'll do my best. This 
this is important, so remember it.
Now loading. Yay! The gear is almost complete. Neptune's and my dream is about to be realized. But the world won't stop spinning. Spinny, spinny, whirly, whirly. Girl, this ain't no time for you to have them birds chirping all around your head. Uh-oh, she's looking pretty sick. Big sister face on. Hey, Neptune, are you okay? Yes, thank you for asking. I just got a little dizzy. I don't like seeing you do that to yourself, buddy. With how game industry is, I need you in tip-top shape. That's exactly why I need to do even more to help you. Please try to understand. Right back at you, little Miss Blue. I don't want to become famous if it means you end up barfing and stuff. If I was making myself sick, you'd be all, what the goodness, and tell me the same thing, right? Neptune, you're right. I'm sorry. I'll hand over my dream of uniting game industry to you. I guess I've got to follow through and unite game industry. Sounds like a plot noir would cook up. All right, Aroni. It's time for me to put on my doting gloves and care for my little sister. I'll put some pudding in a pot and hold it over a fire or whatever. It'll help you get better quick. Um, so you're going to feed me boiled pudding? I don't think that will get rid of my nausea. 